Hi folks, Max from Galaxy S3 Root.com. Many of you have been asking me for uh, Galaxy S3 ROM. So here it is uh, for Sprint Galaxy S3. This is probably the killer ROM of all. Um, love this ROM. Anyway, this is the Wicked X ROM. And uh, this is based on the latest Android 4.4.2 firmware on Sprint, uh, ND8. And uh, it is using Ktune as kernel. Uh, which means before the previous version of Wicked X was that you had to upgrade the bootloader and you couldn't downgrade back. This version, I didn't have to upgrade the bootloader. I believe that is because of the K-Tweaker kernel. And also it does have overclocking. Uh, let me go ahead and show you. Use K-Tweaker app. Go to main settings here. Go to CPU settings. Um, go ahead and enable OC steps. Now you can go all the way up to like 2.2 gigahertz. I don't recommend that. Uh, the most I recommend is actually 1.89 gigahertz. That's plenty fast enough. All right. After doing that, uh, make sure you go to main menu and make sure you set on boot. I do recommend about five seconds. So when you reboot, it will overclock uh, by default. Now overclocking, um, you will lose uh, actually use a little bit more battery life. Uh, but uh, this K Tweaker kernel is so awesome that I've noticed that I actually get. Uh, plenty good battery life because it only ramps up when you're playing games or um, you know graphic intensive apps uh, so definitely you can just leave it overclocked and still get excellent battery life uh, one of the things I've noticed with this ROM is that you get excellent battery life all right let's go into some of the cool stuff about this ROM um, it has Galaxy S5 launcher this is the modded launcher and this is the stock theme that comes with uh, the wicked theme here and you can get a bunch of other themes. Uh, set theme, if you go to set theme here. Um, also, if you do flash the TouchWiz themes zip file, uh, it actually comes with a five or six, I think, themes. But um, now you'll get three, six, nine, 12, 15, uh, 18, 19 different themes if you flash that. Um, so you'll be able to switch your phone into LG Flex, uh, Sense, Iron Man, X Note, all these cool themes. Let me go ahead and switch it to my favorite theme here, LG G3. All right, and your Galaxy S3 now turns into a G3. Um, I will actually show you real quick my LG G3, which is my favorite phone these days. Um, so I'm really used to this UI, and you'll notice that uh, it's nearly identical. Pretty cool stuff, huh? Um, I think you can move this. No, I can't move it. The only thing different is that button. Anyway, also this ROM does come with uh, LG G3 keyboard, which I really like. It's a very nice keyboard. Um, this is a keyboard. Ah. Android. Or you can do um, swipe also. Now the good thing with the LG G3 keyboard is that you can resize it. Probably one of the highlights uh, of LG G3's keyboard. And you can go ahead and language and input here. Go, go into settings. And you can go to keyboard height and layout for those of you who've never used an LG G3. And you can change the height, which is awesome. Uh, I don't know why not enough people do this, but you can go ahead and resize it. I actually like it about just about there. So you can just set it just the way you want to. And other than that, um, I showed you all the themes uh, overclocking. A Sprint Hotspot works out of the box. Just turn it on, set it, and forget it. All right, there we go. 4G LTE. Uh, hotspot activated, working just fine. And also 4G LTE, 3G data, just working fine with this ROM. Overall, I really like it. There's some other options, uh, other customizations uh, on this ROM. I'm not going to go over all of them, but uh, I've, see, I've just shown you some of the highlights of it. Um, you're going to definitely love it. You're going to get the latest Android 4.4.2, a bunch of themes, hotspot working, uh, pretty stable, a very stable, a very fast ROM. Um, so definitely check it out for this week's ROM week for Sprint Galaxy S3. Uh, if you do have it, you're going to love it. Of course, you can't, um, you can't use it for other Galaxy S3 models. Oh, I forgot. It, uh, the camera actually does have... Uh, slow and fast motion somewhere. Um, here we go, shooting mode. Well, I'll let you play with that. Uh, let's actually end it there. Well, let's show me these, some of the options here. HDR, smile shot, low light, 
Um, there you go. Overall, very nice ROM. Love this ROM. Uh, if you have a Sprint Galaxy S3, this is the ROM you should be running on if you want TouchWiz. Um, if you don't want TouchWiz, there's a ton of ROMs. You can get the CM11. I think Snapshot M10 just came out today. So definitely check that out. And also Gummy ROM. Love that ROM. Another good option. Also, you do get uh, quick... Uh, what is it? Quick uh, pull-up. You can set here. Uh, this is you know your shortcut you can set it to gallery your camera um, also you can disable it uh, by going here you can disable it all that good stuff and change the transition effect which is part of the uh, modded s5 rom uh, that's it i think this is getting long anyway thanks guys for watching this video is as long <laughs> anyway thanks guys for watching this video as always if you have a galaxy s3 don't forget to sign up for my email list at galaxy s three root.com and as always Stay hoy on Android.